Hello, welcome to Be Yourself and this is Niti. So today I'm going to talk about Unity, uh, basically the setup of Android in Unity. So let's start Unity. So uh, first of all, where will you get the Unity? Just open the browser and clear, uh, type www.unity3d.com. Uh, let it be open. Uh, you can see get Unity 5. Just click on it. And uh, now you can see the two version, free version and the monthly subscription version. So I have already installed the free version. So I will open it and it's a very simple process to install it. A very simple process. So I'm not going to talk about that. Uh, just install it and open it. When the first time you will open, you will get something like this. You, uh, you, uh, if, um, if you have already uh, an account in Unity, so you can directly put your email and password and go for a sign or if you don't have just create one and go for it and if you want to work offline just press work offline very nice and now uh, just ignore this part the uh, project part and just open a new project because this, these are my uh, my project so you will not get these things so just open uh, a new project click on new and give some name <coughs> so I'm gonna give the name uh, basic tutorial and give the location i'm gonna give my location to document tutorial uh, there is already one basic tutorial so let me change the name basic tutorial uh, basic tutorial android okay so just choose the location uh, document inside tutorial select folder use 3d or 2d okay if you want to make a 2d game just use 2d and if you want a game 3d then press 3d so now just create project hold for a second it will take some time okay you can see this is your scene sorry this is your scene this is your game view this is the project this is the console uh, where you get the message and you will get the message about the, any error or anything so i'm not going to talk about this things uh I'm, i will just set up a android in your unity so that you can make a game for the android game so let's go to edit and go into preferences and in preferences go into external tools and here you can see the android sdk so just click on a browse button and go for it wherever you save your sdk or your download streak as you can install it just select that folder and click ok uh, you will get another option for jdk uh, just browse it and choose the same location and put it there okay so now uh, let me tell you where you will get the sdk and jdk so let's open the browser and search for android as sorry android sdk only android sdk okay and you can see download android studio and sdk tools just download this one and install it and open our uh, sorry sdk manager and install each and everything let me show you i have actually eclipse so i will show you by using eclipse you can download the android studio almost both are same so don't be confused let you open it will take some time okay uh, <coughs> So it's okay. Okay, now let me tell you one more thing about JDK. JDK, just press, uh, just enter JDK and click on the first link. Go for that Java platform. Okay, and according to you, choose your OS. Uh, I have uh, Windows 64 bit OS, so I will choose this one. Click it and download it and install it. After installing, you will get. Uh, Java file inside your program files if you will download uh, if you will install in a default position here you can see Java just open it and the first JDK 1.7 points uh, this is the version uh, the version that you will download the will uh, that you will install you will get it here so just double click on it just copy these things copy it and paste in the JDK place okay so it's so easy no problem very nice and for SDK okay I think yeah we have opened the Eclipse now let's go to project the same like the Eclipse you will get the same things in your Android SDK 
and search for the uh, SDK manager okay so here we go uh, this is my SDK manager Android SDK manager just click on it it will open wait for it now you can see just wait for it to check all the updates and details uh, it takes few times okay now you can see just ignore this part this part this part this part okay the very lowest version of android means 2.2 or you can use 2.3 okay any of the one i install it uh, as you see i have installed android 2.1 just click on it to install okay and in extras just use uh, that android support repository android support library google play service Google Play Library and uh, Google Play Billing Library. If you if you have some in-app purchase in your game, so that you can use this. Better to install it before. Okay, this one is very important. Uh, Google USB driver, and you can use it. Android Auto API simulator. That's it. And just go in the very uh, latest version of Android. You can see Android 6.0. Click on it. You can see the every thing you uh, you selected so just install everything or you can select some of them just like uh, you don't need a documentation so don't install it don't need a sample don't install it uh, let it be installed and that's it okay and just click here install uh, when you will install uh, it will create a folder for SDK uh, as I have installed in e drive so you can see uh, I have the SDK in the E drive and just select this part this link copy it and go in a SDK and paste it that's it you have set up for that Android Android okay so okay we will see you in the next video for now bye bye